Hi guys. Uh, you all got my video this morning. I wanted to keep it short as I was trying to play around with different things. Uh, I'm recording on my phone which seems to work well. I did a couple long recordings this morning and uh, found out that my storage was full which meant um, my video got lost but that's alright so I'm going to do short videos, send them out so I don't have to delete all of my family videos. So here it is, 1.30 sitting here having a cup of tea. Are you surprised? You shouldn't be. Um, and talking about you and this and what's going on. I just want to let you all know, as your parents have told you and other people have told you, you are safe, you are fine, you don't need to worry about that stuff. We're just trying to keep people uh, from getting the virus, mostly elderly people or people with breathing problems or so other kinds of medical conditions are at risk. So we're just trying to stay away from each other so we don't cough, sneeze, and all that stuff on top of each other and spread the virus. So, um, sort of the whole country's doing this. Most kids in America are out of school. We had a couple weeks before Easter break and then we were gonna have our Easter break or our spring break as it may be for you. And um, so a couple weeks off, a little bit longer than we planned for the packet. A um, Couple things that you should have at home if you don't have them already. Number one, a pencil. Uh, all the things, you can get this at Walgreens. You can get this at Tops. You can get this anywhere. If you don't have a sharpener, you might want to get a little mechanical pencil. Also get a pad of paper if you don't have one, because we're going to need some paper. The packet we did was a just-in-case thing. Um, we got a in-case, so we're going to use some paper for a couple things. Uh, not too much uh, above than what we would normally do. Um, the other thing is you might want a set of index cards because one thing that I need to see all of my students doing is practicing their math facts every single day. That's right, I have heard in conferences that some of you do not like to practice your math facts. In fact, some of you I've heard have even thrown a fit. Well, we're not gonna do that right now. Set a time after lunch, after each Cocoa Puffs, pull out the flat flashcards and spend four minutes doing it. That's it, every day a little bit. I am gonna give a multiplication test when we get back, and we will be back, so you better be ready. Um, so, normal day, what? It's about 1.30 now, it'll be a normal day. We'd be wrapping things up, except for one thing, it's, it's oh, it's the, it's the vernal equinox, the spring equinox. Remember we talked about that back in the fall, we talked about it in the winter, we talked about the equinox in the fall solstice in the winter, we got another equinox. If you remember, equa, equilateral, equation, that means equal, nox means night, equal day and night. That's today. First day of spring. Very exciting. Uh, exciting day, but the most important thing about today is that it's Emily's birthday. So we would have her sitting up on her chair right now. We would be having some delicious treats and we would all be singing to Emily. So feel free to join in. One, two, three. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Emily. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday. See you again soon, everybody. I'm going to send another short video in a little bit. Bye.